Hello guys, welcome to the new video. This is a short tutorial how to move away from uncover jailbreak and install Odyssey jailbreak uh, on your iPhone. Now, before we go into it, uh, Odyssey jailbreak version 10101 is now available for download and it's made open source. And I've heard from several sources that the uh, jailbreak is smoother and that it doesn't get so many resprings. However, I didn't have any issues with Uncover, but based on the popular demand by the viewers, I'm here preparing and I'm gonna do it for the first time in front of you on my only jailbroken device in the house, iPhone 11 Pro Max, which you can see. So this is Pro Max. The first thing what we need to do, I'm gonna show the first step now. I need to put my device into non-jailbroken state. If you, if you can see, I have it jailbroken with Uncover. There is app, there is Cydia, everything is there. And here one, you see, this is a tweak which locks my devices. I have five icons, which means that this device is jailbroken currently. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, restore restore root FS. So I'm gonna take this in the Uncover app, which basically means that it's gonna remove all the tweaks, everything I have inside. So be careful if you don't, if you want to start from scratch, you can do this. If you don't wanna do, you can try without this thing. It's gonna work probably uh, the same way, but I just want to make my phone clean before I uh, convert to Odyssey jailbreak. So I'm gonna do restore root FS and it's gonna do its job. Another disclaimer is that instead of Cydia, you will have Cilio installed on with you for your Odyssey jailbreak. Okay, so this is done. It's gonna ask to reboot my device. I also want to mention that this is the uh, option with Alt Store to remove it because uh, no PC, no Mac option still for me, it's not stable. Uh, I know that there is uh, there are videos that show that now you can do it and sign IPA files, but I am really sure, I'm pretty sure that Apple is gonna close it. So I prefer PC method, uh, Mac method. I don't have a PC, so I'm showing it on my Mac. So what you wanna do, and there is a short tutorial which is going to be now up, which shows how you will install Alt Store on your phone, on your Mac and on your phone. So I already have it installed in order to prove it to you. Okay, my device is uh, has opened now. I'm gonna go to Mail app and you will see in the preferences pane here, the plugins, you will see that I have this plugin Alt plugin mail bundle uh, thingy, right? So this proves that I have installed Alt Store on my on my uh, Mac. Here it is, right? And uh, it says uninstall mail plugin, which means that I have installed mail plugin. So you need to follow the steps that I'm showing in the tutorial above, right? So my phone, uh, yes, as you can see, I don't have jailbreak. I don't have uh, Cydia anymore. All my tweaks that I had, iFile, that I had Odyssey and other things installed, they disappeared. Uncover is still here and I can do the jailbreak, but now we want to do the uh, jailbreaking thing through Odyssey. Since my uh, internet connection is not very cool, good, I'm gonna connect my Mac with Alt Store installed. I'm gonna connect it to my, to my phone actually to the dock. <clears throat> it gives me here to update the software. Of course, don't do that. Otherwise, you will not be able to jailbreak your device, All right? So uh, what I need to do now, I need to install Alt Store on my, on my phone. As, as I showed you, you already have it there. Okay, let me input my credential. It should install, yes, this may take a few seconds to install Alt Store on my iPhone. There you go. This is this is the Alt Store. So when we start, it says untrusted developer, of course. So you need to go to settings. You need to go to uh, general. You need to go to profiles, profiles management. And we need to click the recent one and say trust, right? In order to 
to start the app. So I'm gonna start my alt store. It says, okay, notifications, fine. So now I just have alt store here. I have nothing else. The point is here also that you need to sign with the same Apple ID you did for signing in on your Mac. So I'm gonna do that. Okay, so alt store is installed. Everything is fine, right? I have my free developer account and it should be working now. Now, what do we do? We go to Safari and we go to theodyssey.dev in order to download the Odyssey file. And here at the end, you have two options to download the IPA file or the install via alt store. Click install via alt store and we wait for a few seconds. So I have Odyssey jailbreak sideloaded through alt store. That's it. When I go to Odyssey, as you can see, enable tweaks. I have settings here. What is this? Show again. Okay, okay. Different, different themes. I can go back, I think. Yeah, credits. So the only thing we need to do, we need to hit the jailbreak button. And let's see how this baby works. Of course, you'll need some uh, extra work to get back your tweaks. But actually, I prefer this thing so you can even clean your iPhone. A little bit if you have uh, installed many tweaks all right the phone booted up the phone booted up and we will start odyssey again because sometimes these things don't work uh, at once so i'm gonna hit the jailbreak once once again and let's see how it works however if your uncover works well I, I don't see any reason why you should do this i'm just doing it for those of you guys who suggested that I might try it and give you a quick tutorial for you to do it. And this is, I, I did it for the first time myself. I haven't done it before, the Odyssey jailbreak. So I'm moving from Uncover to Odyssey and hopefully in the next few minutes, we will have my iPhone jailbroke in a jailbroken state. Looking forward to it. Alrighty. Again, we have the phone restart. And yes, this is the sign that you made it. You did a good job. So you have Celio installed here in the lower right corner. When we go to Celio, you will have, of course, similar interface like Cydia. You have sources, you have packages, you have many things. Of course, it's a little bit uh, new and, you know, looks cooler than Cydia. Uh, actually, I prefer Cydia, but anyway, you know, it's so it's it works really nice, really nice, you know. So uh, the whole the whole um, jailbreaking process was very painless. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Very straightforward. Moving from this, moving from Uncover to to Odyssey. Let me know what you think. If there are any steps I may have missed, let me know what you think about the experience on Odyssey. Do you have issues with Odyssey more or less than Uncover? Uh, etc. So uh, that's it. Peace.